The Greater Vancouver Food Truck Festival took over the Prospera Place parking lot on Saturday, where six different vendors served up different dishes through a drive through style event. So the Greater Vancouver Food Truck Festival started in 2014. We started off with one event in Chilliwack, just, you know, see how things go, get a bunch of food trucks together and have some fun. And all of a sudden we had 8,000 people show up. So for, fast forward to 2020, things have changed a lot. And uh, we've now kind of pivoted into a drive through food truck festival model. So this is actually our first drive through food truck festival outside of the Lower Mainland. We brought a couple of our friends up from the mainland. We're working with a bunch of local food trucks as well. And we're just trying to provide people some alternatives and maybe some better food. You know, this is something that we had to pivot to to keep a lot of small businesses alive, you know, including our own. Um, because there are no more large events, you know, for and for obvious reasons, you know, we can't gather anymore. We can't have more than 50 people in one place. <laughs> The drive-through model kind of allows these small businesses to have an avenue to, to still sell and, and, and put food on the table. We're a gourmet mini donut uh, trailer. We serve mini donuts with toppings on them like uh, Boston cream, maple bacon, salted caramel. The Boston cream is the most popular because it's kind of a classic everyone knows about. So when they see it on mini donuts, they get excited about it. This pandemic probably isn't going to go away anytime soon. so. This is the new normal, and we want people to still be able to enjoy, you know, more than just traditional fast food, um, and to support, support local business. So, you know, if, if people come out and do this, we'll take care of you, and, and hopefully you come and take care of all these local businesses. If you missed the event on Saturday, not to worry. The Food Truck Festival continues on Sunday from 12 to 8 p.m. For Castanet News, I'm Miriam Halpenny in Kelowna.